So this is the answer. As you see, the scorecard will be created. The scorecard is generated. That's it. That means not run, just we have created the scorecard. See now the color is So there is no use of photo. So now we will run the scorecard. We can after running the scorecard only we will come to know what is the invalid row, see what is the total row, invalid row, what is the score, everything we can see. So now create it. So now run the scorecard, right click on any column, run the score. So run it. Red and color function. That means red and decade in the invalid data. Green will say having good data. Yellow and decade is some at, at least acceptable data that we are having. That means, so now how to check why these are invalid. Why it is in red data here? See now, customer having 2499 credit card. Invalid of 2495 is invalid. And this is not valid. That is valid. It seems. So now, we see what is something they have, they have mentioned to get this type of color. So, this one, right click on this one, go edit metric, click on the general. So, this general option, we can, if you want, you can read the scorecard and you can provide the description also. So, now I am providing this one. It is a all customer data. Only thing in the general, we can read it. And you can provide the description if possible. Remaining nothing we can't change. Mm -hmm. Next option is metrics. Mm -hmm. Metrics. You can see what is why is the invalid and valid. If you see here, they mentioned wrongly. They are valid because if you see a null, there is a valid case because it's wrong. But the values. This should be a valid case here. You see, valid and of null. What is switching as invalid? It is then what I will do is I will change the logic. Select the columns this side, I mean rows this side, select them into this side. That means this is a valid data, this is a valid data. Take one more column called suppose customer type. You see the customer here, there is only diamond is a valid value, remaining is not invalid. What I will do is click up and all the things will go to the value. Wherever the number is there, or else the null is invalid. Wherever the number is also there, I am considering as a invalid. This is invalid because it is a string car. So now if you see, these are the customer tires. Diamond, ruby, emerald, bronze, gold, silver. This is the value data I have. So these are all, these are all invalid. Yeah. So now we run this core card. See, like this, you can specify one of the columns you want. You can specify the value already values. See here, the score T5 to 100, it is showing as good. That means it's a it's valid data. The score T5 to 94, it is showing as yellow color. That is called acceptable record. So it's called as a bad data. It's an unacceptable data. That's what it's red color. So now, the same one, you can able to figure out the change. See now, that is the customer ID is having 2, 4, and 9, 5 is a valid record. So invalid and every 4 only valid. Now you see, 2 total and 9, there is an invalid only 4 record, that is null record. Mm -hmm. If you see now, 9.8 for every it's like something, very uh, 0.16 or something. See now, if it has a green color, you see that the error is going up. That means the score is moving up. Here, there are two options called valid invalid data. What is that? So, if you want to see the data of the first core card, you can go to this, this option called drill down. This will show you this. So, you can click on this option. This is called a down. You can be able to get it in the down, in the bottom. Mm -hmm. So, I click on this uh, 
build out. Let's see <coughs> what value that in the custom ID is see. In the custom time for null. So now I want the value data. So let this out. So now I have one another requirement in the scorecard. See now it will more graphically. Some color there. This thing, at least we can we can take a screenshot of this, you can show the data to the client. It's they can understand. See total rows, score, they, they can understand this. But if you see the profile, how they understand it is difficult them to understand. Yes. So now, one thing I have to do is see now I have a requirement now. See, I have a name and first name is there. So, when the last name is first position, first name is available in the last position, so available in the here. But I have to see all name information in one group. They don't want that. Suppose, see now, last name is here, first name is middle name in between. Suppose you have, uh, uh, I mean, thousands of columns in the real time, they don't go and such like this. They want the, all the name information in only one place, in one group. Mm -hmm. How could that? So, same right here, grid matrix, go to option. I mean, here we see earlier, general we see, matrix means you can get valid in valid values, and thousand matrix groups. That means you can create a group. So if you have that particular comes that group, so mm -hmm. it will show in a separate I mean bottom of the score. Just you add it. The group what I'm getting is suppose So full added. So I have in the lay existing group. Want to be this one. <coughs> Everything. Go to go to three groups and add a new group called full name information. Okay. So you see one group is added here. So uh, that is available. The particular full name is available to down. See now, the full group is coming down. And if you want to add the columns to this group, then so now I want to add these two columns. So that is group. Right? Move. Mm -hmm. Then select what is the value I want. Full name group I want to go. Two columns from the display. So now all that you can see in that only one place. Mm -hmm. The third one is the notification. What is the notification? So now see, if you go for the name, the analyst is dealing with the hundreds of files, hundreds of scorecards. So he, he can't go and check and region every profile and scorecard, right? So what do we? They will automation. That means so see in this particular table, whatever the scroll down. That means if it moves down, if it is I mean bad data is added to the column, then it will be into red column. So that's what that means whenever the score moves down, they want to get an email notification. How is first email notification? Suppose what the columns you want, you can select it. I only that uh, these are not null columns. I have only four. So these three columns I want whenever these columns having some, I mean, adding some bad data, the score down, then I want to get an automatic email alert with option. Yes. So now I have selected these three columns. So now I'm setting button. So now I want to send an email notification. See. The score unacceptable. I want to send an email notification and the score moves down. That means some 90 to 80 or something is going down. Then I want to send an email notification. See now, I am having admin.example is the email ID. 
but this is the real time i am giving that who is administer i mean informatic analyst so is the event is easy dot so now when we specify like this now we don't need to edit the thing when you do add it automatically see it will pick the score card name and those cards uh, i mean score card url and what is metric everything it will select from the score card so all is select from the score card it will and like this see this all information so what you will get you will get email like the amplification of the scorecard so it is scorecard name equal to this because i mean what is the scorecard name we give, given you it will give us see this url everything automatically send it to the administrator i mean in informatic analysis so this will provide you the automation whenever the i mean because they have to pull profile some scorecard right so when they get the email they will look into that so this we can generate The, uh, I mean notification also. Okay. I mean remaining options if you see, right click, each option will get. Suppose if you want to delete some invalid columns to the scorecard, you can delete. Also, suppose I see here, I have field 20, field 21. I am considering this is invalid field. I will delete from the scorecard. Right click, delete. So the columns will be deleted. You know, delete. Mm -hmm. The option in the scorecard is drill down. Drill down means I, I already told right this is the option. Error. Well, you don't go this uh, the, this right side. I want to see here itself in the case right click. Drill down. You know, somebody had phone number. You can see like this. Delete down, directly here, or else the right. So short is nothing, but it's like a graph. Values is, I mean, going. Suppose how the trend is going. So trend is nothing but a multiple patterns of a scorecard. So how is like just like a graph? Click on this one. I need a graph for customizing. Now see. Red, green in the case acceptable, good. Yellow in the case acceptable. Red in the case unacceptable. So now this is the first one. So now we are earlier. So now it is move to green. So now the second one we ran right against the green. Suppose score is down right, it will come like the whole. Okay. The score is like almost hundred is going here. Currently we are not changing. In some data is added, some bad data data is added. Will come some seventy five like seventy. See, I am seeing for customer ID, total number of records, invalid, and current score is 19.84. So we are seeing for last 10 runs. This is this guy. Yeah. So if you want the runs, you can also select this. So this is the trend chart. Is the adaptation is if you want any one of the trend chart. So trend chart is but a multiple pattern of a score card. We call it as a trend chart. Mm -hmm. So in this so scorecard now, so anyway, this remaining option is not required. So this tool, I mean, lineage and the tax is not required anyway. Tax in the case, some I mean, some description regarding some 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 something like that. But anyway, it's not required. You never use this tax on that. So the main thing is this still screenshot we use. So you have out in this scorecard, you can ask. Okay. So do you practice? This you see, and this is not anywhere. I'm saying anyway, you, uh, you download this video and keep it with you practice. Or still you are not able to follow, then uh, then, then let me. So then we will. Sir, can you please uh, share me that uh, sample practice?